Hey YouTube. YouTube! We're Sharon and Marvik. We are Primed and Primed and today we're back with another talking video. Finally! So this is our first ever favourites video. And we're doing it for the month of May. We figured we really liked watching favourites videos on YouTube, so... Here we are! Yeah. Stick around to the end, we also have an announcement. Oh, two, two announcements! announcements um, that we would really, really love to share with you guys. So we've split everything up into five categories, mm -hmm. and the first category is beauty. The first beauty slash skincare kind of an item that's my favourite this month is this fragrance, which I got as a gift. It's the Bleu de Chanel. Bleu de Chanel? Yeah. If I were to describe it uh, as a scent, like initially it does smell a bit like parsley, but after mm. a while it sort of dies down and it's really sort of... A it's a beautiful fragrance, yeah. really. It it's always smells like sick. that. Sick! Yeah! So my first beauty favourite is a lipstick by YSL, and it's the Rouge Per Couture. If anyone is French, please correct me. Now Sydney is going into autumn and winter, so I'm really liking the darker nudes, mm -hmm. like leaning more towards the brown side. And the consistency is just really smooth. It's a splurge it's item. It's a splurge. It really yeah. is a splurge item. The next category is kind of like music slash movies. So for this month, I've really been loving music, and the one song that I'm absolutely obsessed with is Christine by Christine and the Queens. It is amazing. Check it out. It's French. I'm really into electronic music. I really like some of the future classic artists, like obviously Flu. My favourite song of this month is one by Chrome Sparks and it's called Send the Pain On. So, so good. The music video is so psychedelic and it has like two ballet Ooh. dancers and then like a montage of, of videos behind them. It's really sick. That's cool. Yeah. We're not too sure if people really have this category in their favourites, but we are such a massive YouTube fan. Oh yeah, so one of our other categories are our favourite YouTube channels. Yes. YouTube! Right. My favourite YouTube channel of the month has been Tipsy Bartender. And I know it's sort of really weird, but I sometimes <laughs> spend like hours and hours on end just watching people make cocktails. Wow, this one. He's an alcoholic. alcoholic. No. So if you haven't seen like this YouTube channel, definitely check it out because it is amazing, mm. it's sick, and it's really addictive. So one of my favourite categories on YouTube to watch are makeup gurus and like makeup mm. tutorials. And I love Chloe Morello. She's Australian as well. Woo -woo, and I, I watch exactly and I watch some of her videos and she's like, oh I'm vlogging in Bondi. I'm like, oh I know where that is. I think I'm a street. <laughs> yeah, wishing. Yeah. I kind of do. Yeah, a it's little like bit. It's one really long shit. Yeah. She has like an amazing sense of humour and mm -hmm. every time I watch her videos, I just feel so happy afterwards. Like it's not overly, it's not superficial, it's just really light-hearted and hilarious. Yeah. So check her out. She's real cool. I mean, I'm not even into beauty and I've seen mm. her videos. And she looks like, um, she's cute. She looks like that Victoria's Secret model. Candace! Candace, Candace Swanepoel. Like yes. a mix between Candace Swanepoel and mm. Miranda Kerr. Do oh yeah, those, like, I'm seeing it. Both? Oh yeah. yeah, I'm seeing that. Next category is miscellaneous. We really didn't know what category to really put these items yeah. under. It's kind of just random. Yeah. 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 So the one thing that I've been loving this month is this book by Connor Franta. If you're a YouTube fan, you know what I'm talking about. And this is seriously so amazing. Oh. It is like, I don't even know. It's like a memoir of his life. It is very, very deep, very inspiring, and I love it. Actually, everyone's been, oh my god! <laughs> everyone's been reading that book. Really. Yeah. Like, I've, it's, it's everywhere. I mean, I haven't read it, but yeah, it's should like, I? It's like a bestseller, like Barnes and Nobles, Ooh, Amazon. Six. Amazon. Get onto that. Love Amazon. Okay, so my random item or miscellaneous thing are candles. One of my favorite things to do when, when I'm just at home mm -hmm. and doing my homework. Yeah. Party animals, are, aren't we? Right. Yeah. <laughs> I discovered this new candle brand called Kaya Candles. Mm -hmm. And this one is fresh coffee. I am telling you, smell it. It literally smells yep. like a caramel latte. Oh, it smells so good. I burn it in the morning and it just 
wakens the entire house up. Mm -hmm. Our next and final category mm -hmm. uh, is a clothing piece, and we're gonna put it in an outfit for you guys as well. So it's yeah. not just like, oh, I like this t-shirt. Yeah. Wow, that was really lame. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite clothing slash like fashion piece for this month has been these pair of shoes. These beloved Doc Martin shoes. Oh, don't put them too close to your face. It's like feet. Oh, disgusting. So the shoes are all white, the soles are white, the exterior is white, the laces are white, and I'm just absolutely obsessed. I styled the shoes with this outfit. It's just basic monochrome, black and white. I wore a marble shirt, and over the top of that is just a regular black bomber jacket, all of which from Top Man. Uh, my slacks are from ASOS, and... The shoes are Doc Martens? Yeah. My fashion slash clothing favourites mm -hmm. has been this pink coat from Ooh. ASOS. Somehow I'm getting really into pastels mm -hmm. in the winter, especially pastel pink. I've paired this outfit with so many pieces that aren't even mine. My favourite outfit technique of the month, borrowing clothes from either your mum or your boyfriend. So the sweatshirt is my boyfriend's and since it's uni I literally just borrow his clothes. The jeans are from Mavi Jeans and the shoes are my mum's. So thanks for sticking to the end of our monthly favourites. Yay, high five to you! <laughs> our first announcement is we want to say a massive thank you to all of you guys. Yeah. We just hit... 1,000 subscribers! Yay! Which is great because we have a little community of friends on YouTube that we love talking to. We love interacting with you guys. <laughs> uh, Thebomb.com Our second announcement, and probably the biggest announcement of all, is... We actually now work for ASOS. AU. ASOS Australia. ASOS Australia <laughs> as student editors. So we both go to UTS and we are these student editors for our uni. So UTS is University of Technology Sydney, oh. Reppin UTS. Ooh. Out of the entire country, 10 people get chosen from mm. around different cities in Australia. Yeah. And... We have been lucky enough to be a part of such an amazing group. Like yeah, everybody, most everybody on the ASOS team is <sighs> extremely lovely. Yeah extremely talented talented yes. so like if you ever want to like have a look at what we're writing what we're creating we usually take a lot of street star photos definitely we would definitely chuck a link down below and just have a look have a browse and like have a look at everybody else's stuff too mm -hmm. it's amazing exactly um, and if you're not from australia you'll see what our campus looks like see how australians dress at uni mm -hmm. so that should be interesting for international people people <laughs> I really hope you liked the video and again, thank you so much for watching. As always, you can follow us on our social media links down below and um, we'll see you next time. See you next time. Bye. Bye. This month, random. Oh my god, I hate <laughs> that word so much. Blue Deschanel. It was that you say it? Yeah, you're like butchered it, Gaga. <laughs> if you haven't checked them out, <laughs> <laughs>